guys, so I am disgustingly sick. Not disgustingly, but I'm just like sick and I feel like shit. And um, it's Friday, so I've never like taken off on a Friday and usually it would be like so perfect because then you get like a three day weekend. But this weekend, is, it's not fun to have off on a Friday. So I'm just sitting here, it's like 11 a.m. I'm having my breakfast. I slept till like 10 a.m. Um, I called in sick to work at like 6.45 this morning and I'm having oatmeal and coffee. I never drink coffee, but I love this mug that I got when I worked at Bed Bath & Beyond. It's a Starbucks clear mug with a little etched um, like trees, Christmas trees. And I got the... Um, peppermint mocha k-cups from the donut shop and the peppermint mocha like creamer and it's pretty good I can't really taste it too much I can really taste the um, brown sugar and the oatmeal it feels so good on my throat and um, I had like a spoonful of natural honey this morning and that felt amazing on my throat like that was like orgasmic it felt so good and um but I wanted to vlog today because I never get to vlog with you guys anymore I'm always so busy and tired and I'm tired right now but I feel like I've been watching everyone's vlogmas and it makes me really want to vlog so I'm not really gonna do a lot today but my mom was working on our Christmas tree this morning she took off today anyhow like she was taking today off um to do fun stuff with my sister because Rachel's home for Christmas vacation as of last Friday and it's been so fun to have Rachel home I missed her so much we've been watching a lot of Brooklyn Nine-Nine and just hanging out we did so much stuff this week uh we me and my dad saw Arrival on Tuesday and Rachel and my mom saw the Fantastic Beast movie again Arrival is incredible. It's so amazing to see it multiple times because you just get more and more and more out of it. It's one of my favorite movies I've ever, ever seen. I want to see it again. And I really hope that Amy Adams wins Best Actress for it because the award nominations have come out for the, um, the Golden Globes and the SAG Awards. And she's nominated for Best Actress in a Drama in both. And so I'm hoping she wins one of those, if not an Oscar. And on Wednesday, what did we do? We did, so oh, my mom's um, <laughs> work Christmas party was on Wednesday. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, you saw what I wore to the party. It was like a light up sweater. It's it was such a big hit. It was so much fun. It's such a great conversation piece. I want to wear it like every single day until Christmas now. It makes everyone happy and it makes me really happy. So it was really fun. And then last night I cooked a plated meal and um, edited a video that's going to go up today. Filmed a video of my makeup collection that I'm going to post probably this weekend. This weekend I'm planning on going to visit Michael and I really need to get better today because I'm driving there tomorrow. So I hope that I feel better by then. So I'm just trying to have as much like warm foods and drinks as possible and just rest and do as little as possible so I can feel <laughs> better. It's mostly just my throat. I don't really have like a headache or like a fever uh, it really just feels like my throat is so dry and scratchy and um, some people at work were sick and I hate when people come into work sick like I know you don't want to take sick days and you want to do your work because there's so much to be done at the end of the year but if you're sick you're gonna get other people sick innocent people like me so I'm kind of pissed like about that but uh, what can you do? Thankfully, I I didn't think I was going to be sick today, but I finished like, pretty much everything that I had to do for the week yesterday, so it's not like I had to be there today, so that really worked out. I'm very thankful about that. So here is our tree so far. We don't have a star on the top yet, but my mom was putting on 
some decorations and I'm so impressed that we got this tree up already because next week I can't believe it is already Christmas last year I don't think we got our tree up until like the week of Christmas so we're definitely improving I want to show you guys a few ornaments this I got obviously at the Shake Shack and I love it Shake Shack is one of my favorite things I discovered this year and this ornament is just too cute this ornament I got last year for my mom from Vera Bradley you can see the year I think this is so beautiful if I get to a Vera Bradley boutique this year, I really want to get my mom another one because I think that they're so gorgeous and my mom really does like to collect ornaments. And then my absolute favorite ornament that is so, so special to me this week, my friend and subscriber Kate sent me this amazing ornament that she made. So she's the one that has worked on Zootopia and Moana and I just think she's so amazing and she's so sweet and an amazing supporter of my channel and she asked me if she could send me a little something for Christmas and this was so unexpected. I just can't believe it. She made this ornament with all sorts of scenes from Moana including ones that she worked on and she is one of the animators so I think that it's such a cute ornament in general like I love the pearls and this movie was just amazing I love these pictures from like the beach scenes it's just so so special thank you so much Kate I'm gonna treasure this for the rest of my life and it is so amazing I can't wait to show it off to the rest of my family around Christmas time but me my parents and my sister are so amazed and so grateful for your generosity and sweetness so I'm always gonna try to make myself useful today and start wrapping Christmas presents we got these really cute wrapping papers from Costco it was in a set of four different styles I just think they're really really cute and pretty I showed you guys these Christmas cards in my Black Friday haul and these from Julie Ann Art on Etsy. I love those. And then also gift bags are anyone's best friend around this time of year. These are two packs from Target for a dollar. So definitely wanted to get some of those. Next, I'm going to show you guys some presents that I got. If you're any of my friends in real life, that means Chloe, Caitlin, Alyssa, Felipe, and Michael. Please do not watch the next clip. I'm sure you're not, but just in case. Okay, so I'm pretty much done with everyone. I want to get Michael a few like stocking stuffer things, but this is what I got him so far. So we love Shake Shack and the first one that we ever went to was in Brooklyn. And so Shake Shack on their website has all the different like cities that they have Shake Shack locations in. They have different like art um, t-shirts. So I got him this one and I love it. I think it's so cool and I really think he's gonna like it. So I got him this and a Shake Shack gift card and he's obsessed with Burt's Bees chapstick. So I got him this. It was like $10. They have it at Ulta and Target and stuff. Then for Alyssa, I'm so excited about this. So she loves peacocks and I'm gonna put a picture of us in here. I got it at Cracker Barrel. It's just so Alyssa and so perfect and I can't wait to pick out a picture to put in here. And then this I'm even more excited about. So Alyssa is a diehard T-Swift fan and I saw this magazine at Target and it's all about Taylor and like I don't know it's just really really cool like the history of Taylor, current Taylor, past Taylor, all articles about her and I don't know I think she'll really really enjoy it and wouldn't buy this for herself it was kind of expensive for a magazine but it's definitely a collector's piece and I think she's gonna absolutely love it so and I also got her a Birchbox subscription for three months so that is what I'm gonna giving to Alyssa for Secret Santa, I got Felipe. I get Felipe almost every single year, and it's kind of funny because 
I don't know why I just always freaking get him but this year he asked for like cool dress socks and that was perfect for me because you guys know I'm like obsessed with the brand happy socks right now so I got him this set on Black Friday it's such a nice like presentation this is like a magnetic box and then it comes with four different patterns of socks and Michael told me how much he like I bought Michael these brand of socks and he loves them so I think Felipe is really really gonna like them and uh, I'm super excited to give that to him then for Chloe we always give each other makeup gifts so these are some of the things that I'm most excited about I got her one of these little it cosmetic superhero mascara ornaments I thought that this would be really fun she asked for this way hair care set so it comes with um, three deluxe sizes of their products and then hair ties and this is at Sephora for $25 so She's trying to get into her hair, like, styling it. She's getting her hair cut today. So I hope she really, really likes this. And this is a great way to try this brand. And she is so into beauty blenders. And I found this set on Derm Store for only 20 or 40 Sorry. It would be amazing if it was only $20. It was $40. But you get the Blotterazzi, a Micro Mini, two beauty blender sponges, and the Solid Cleanser. I think this is such an amazing deal. And, um, yeah, if you have any, like, makeup lovers that love the Beauty Blender or have wanted to try it, this is so much bang for your buck. Then for Caitlin this year, I, this is just the beginning of her present. I'm doing, like, a whole makeup, I'm calling it, like, a makeup starter kit, even though she has makeup, but she's really, really, really gotten into doing cosplay. She's such an amazing like seamstress and she's so so creative she's amazing you you guys can follow her on instagram i'll link it down below but i wanted to get her some like supplies so she could do more makeup for the cosplay desi designs and also just like in general so i got her two real techniques brush sets the core collection and the eye starter kit both of these are at Target on their website right now for a really, really low price. They are way more expensive at Ulta. So I'm so excited to give her these because these brushes are so high quality and so amazing. Then I got her like contour kits, eyeliners, brow products, blush palette. Um, Ulta has a really, really cute becca moonstone little kit for twenty dollars so i'm just getting her like a plethora of makeup that she can play around with and i know makeup really adds up quickly so she might not want to splurge on it for herself so i hope that she really likes that present so those are all the gifts that i have for my friends so far i have stuff for like my sister and I just thought of an idea for my dad the other night. Michael actually inspired it. So me and my sister have to go grab that. And I think, don't tell my mom, but I think what I'm going to do for my mom is give her like an IOU to go to the spa. And I think that that would be really, really fun, like to go together. So I get a gift and she gets a gift with it. Um, but I think that would be a really nice treat for her because she never really does anything for herself so I thought that would be a nice little gift and a total surprise she's not expecting it at all so that's that I wanted to tell you guys again this year how amazing the pentatonics album is this is their new Christmas album every song's amazing God rest ye merry gentlemen is definitely my favorite I also love O Come All Ye Faithful they're all so good all of the pentatonics Christmas albums are amazing go buy them, go listen to them. They are so, so talented. It's unbelievable. I'm warning you that I'm going to scare the shit out of you right now. Okay, ready? All right, so now that you're officially scared shitless, um, this is the Leilani mermaid mask. I just woke up from a nap. It's like 4.30. Um, feel better. My throat doesn't feel as shitty, which is very nice and helpful um I wanted to do this mask anyway tonight but I thought I would do it right now and I wanted to mention how much I love this sleeping eye mask I mentioned this before it's by Illuminage and 
it's the most amazing thing for naps because it has like little like pillows where your eyes go so it literally blocks out all the light it's ridiculously expensive i'm not gonna say this has like skincare benefits like it says that it does but if you want a hella good sleep mask that blocks out the light like crazy and it has like an adjustable back so you can make it fit your head perfectly such a good investment really really nice I'm going to work on filling up my makeup bag. I filmed a makeup collection yesterday and so I put like everything in my makeup drawers. But I'm gonna uh, go through everything and put stuff in for the next like few weeks. I haven't gone through my makeup bag in a while so it was needing to be replenished and switched up a little. So that's what I'm gonna do. I think um, my mom and Rachel have been making Christmas cookies so I really want to check out what they've been up to since I was asleep and um, yeah I think I'm just gonna have like water and honey or something like heat up water I really don't like tea but I really don't like coffee either and I had two cups of it today because it just felt so good on my throat so I'm gonna do this and listen to PTX Christmas and uh just keep vegging because it's definitely helping I feel a lot better than I did this morning here's some more of our Christmas decorations our very disco -y lights they're so bright. And we have them over the door as well. We have outdoor lights too, but it's not dark enough to turn them on yet. For poinsettia. There's our second tree. I love this little table in our entryway. So cute. Love this Santa picture. And lights. Our elves are making <laughs> cookies. And above our fireplace. How far are you guys along? We made two doughs that are chilling. Wow. And then we're making two right now that we're gonna mm. bake right away. Good job. Oh, I love those bowls. Those are mine. By the way. You know. <laughs> I thought I would show you guys the Sephora order that I made with the $25 off little gift card thing. So it was $25 off of 50 and my total was $51 and then I got the $25 off. So I've been needing a top coat and Nails Inc. is one of my favorite brands. So I got this 45 second top coat with Kensington Caviar and um, I think I might repaint my nails tonight. They're looking kind of shabby. This is such an amazing deal. It's on sale for only $15 right now, which is the price of the 28 pack of facial radiance pads that comes in this. So for the same price as you would just get the facial radiance pads, you also get a travel size of the face cleanser and a full size of the ultra repair lip therapy, which I've never tried. So this is a great little gift for yourself or someone else and it's really, really affordable. Then I decided to get a full size of the Smashbox Eye Primer, the 24 hour photo finish eye primer. I really, really like this stuff. I got a like deluxe size in the Extravagant Eyes kit and I'm almost out of it. So I thought I would pick it up with this sale. And then they had really good um, perfume samples this time. I've been wanting to try the Elizabeth and James Nirvana bourbon. So I'm going to try this out. I don't want to smell them now because I don't think anything would really smell good um, while I'm sick. So I have that to try. Also this replica by the fireplace. And it says that it's a unisex scent. So I'm intrigued about that. And then this was really interesting to me. This is Secret Genius um, by Pinrose and the packaging is beautiful. The bottle is gorgeous and this is like a towelette sample. So the notes of it sounded amazing. Vanilla and caramel. So I don't know. I'm just really intrigued by all these scents and I hope that one of them is a really really good one that I love. So it's just about 8 p.m. and I think I'm going to watch The Parent Trap, one of my favorite movies of all time. Uh, I don't know if I'll even be able to watch the full thing because I'm very, very tired. But I'm feeling so much better than I was this morning or even this afternoon. And I 
think that I'll be okay to go to New Jersey tomorrow. So I'm crossing my fingers that I stay improving like this. I've been trying to drink as many hot liquids and take like all the precautions that I possibly can because obviously I don't want to get Michael and his family sick. Like I would feel so, so guilty. Um, but my throat is feeling so much better and um, I just can't talk as much as normal, which might be appreciated by some people. So <laughs> you probably couldn't tell that from this vlog because I've been chatting nonstop with you guys. But I hope you guys had an amazing day. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Talking to you guys definitely made me feel a lot better today. And I will see you all really, really soon. Bye.